Okay, so this video is about upgrading old soft mods. Um, this soft mod is Crazy's version one point one point one. Um, I don't even I can't even show you. Um, I'll just go to File Explorer. We'll see here in a second. So, like I said, this is Crazy's soft mod, Nadar soft mod. Um, turn it off, turn it back on. I'm going to use the extras disc to upgrade it to my soft mod. Um, and I'm just going to show you how easy it is. So, the reason I've done this is to make it easier for users who are on older jailbreak, uh, older, no jailbreaks, I think they're PlayStation 3 and iPhones, um, older soft mods, instead of having to go through the process of putting the save on, loading the disc up and stuff like that, I just put it on the disc so that all you do is stick the extras disc in and load it up and select upgrade old soft mod and within a couple of minutes you'll be using my soft mod and you'll have all the security features and stuff like that you won't be able to break it and stuff and it's using the latest NK patch of source so so once it's loaded we obviously go to upgrade old soft mods as it tells you, are you sure? Yes. Select finish upgrade. I give you a chance to back out just in case you didn't want to come here. But yes we do, so we select yes. Now, I ask you what version of Splinter Cell you own, or if you don't own the game, what region is your Xbox from. Um, this is important because there's two versions of the Splinter Cell save. There's the NTSC version and there's the PAL version. You can't interchange them, so you have to select the region. I'm PAL, so I will select yes. This is just copying the Shadow Sea image. And that's us. Take the disc out, or eject the disc, and you'll be presented with this menu. Now you can install the C dashboard by inserting the extras disc, or you can just go straight to finalize install, which I will do. Tells you where your dashboard is located, so you know where to find it. And that's us now using my 2014 soft mod. It's actually that simple. So, as you can see, I'm getting to my settings. And this is what you're presented with my soft mod. So, that's the soft mod. That's the upgrade process from going from an old soft mod to my soft mod. 
Now it doesn't matter what version of soft mode you've got, they all function. So I've tried it on SID and Crazies, Nadar. Um, most later soft mods are all Nadar, so they should all work. So stick the disc in, select upgrade old soft mod, and when three minutes should be on the new version, you'll be on the latest one released. So that's it. And thanks for watching. Okay, bye bye.